In the year 98-99, Andre Agassi and Boris Becker played three games. All Boris Becker beat Andre Agassi because he had such a… you know, he was called Boom Boom because… Boris Becker was called Boom Boom because of the service. His serves were so powerful, there was no game. Every time he will serve, serve and finish the game. Nobody returns the ball. So, Andre Agassi went back and studied hundreds of hours of Boris Becker's serves. Then he figured it out. Then in the next three years, he played eleven games with him and beat him on ten of them. And I'll tell you what happened. After Boris Becker retired, they met in Germany, there's something called the Oktoberfest in Germany, they were there. And at that time, they were together and Andre Agassi thought, okay, anyway he's retired, now I can tell him. Because this bothered Boris Becker big time, nobody can beat him but this guy's getting at him. So he told him, see, I observed your videos continuously and I figured out that whenever you are serving the ball towards the boundary line, B Boris Becker, if you know, when he's serving, his tongue sticks out a little bit. When he throws the ball up and comes down, his tongue sticks out. He said, whenever you are serving towards the boundary line, your tongue goes to the left. When you are serving straight, it comes out straight. I observed this, the moment your tongue sticks out to the boundary line, I was already there every time taking the ball <laughs> So, Boris Becker literally fell off his chair, he couldn't believe this. And he said, any number of times I went home after the matches and I told my wife, he seems to be reading my mind, but you've been reading my tongue <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.